are going to talk all things cut denim today. It is time to get that spring denim refresh in your closet. And there is that hot, hot list of exactly what you need for spring. You need a white denim, you need a cutoff, and you need a great ankle jean. So I've got three that I'm going to show you. We're going to start with, I mean, how much do I love you, gang? How much do I love you that I'm putting on white denim in the middle of February? Whew. Did it? We're going to go with it. Okay, here's the deal about white denim. It's hard to find the right pair for your body. We've all been there. We've been in the dressing room. We've tried on 10 pair. We've left frustrated. So here's the deal. We've got several, several styles that you can try on. I do think this is a trial and error, trial and win situation. You've got to try on a couple pair to see which one fits your body best. But here is a little insider tip. I think if you're going to start anywhere, I'd start with a cut ankle skinny. Now, this is what I'm wearing right now. It is a tried and true silhouette. And I think that is one of the best ways to start your white denim search. Go with a fit you already know and love. This is a best-selling fit from Cut. We love it and all the washes that it comes in. And it's so comfortable and so flattering. So it's not any different in white why we love it. Number one, higher rise. I love that in white denim. It's going to hold me in, make me feel a little more put together. Number two, super stretchy, really comfortable, lots of movement in this puppy. Number three, it's the Goldilocks of weight. It's not too heavy. It's not too thin. So it's thick enough that I'm not going to get that like blah, 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 on the back of my leg, right? hate that but thin enough that on a warm spring or summer day I'm not going to be sweating my tootsies off so really really nice combination now this guy is an ankle length with the raw hem I cuffed it because my five four legs and they're short for my body needed more ankle showing I think that is a critical part of white denim make sure you show your ankle it gives you a longer leg. It is just generally more flattering. Now, here is the outfit I put together. White sneaker, white jean, white sneaker. I like with white jeans, either wearing a nude or a white shoe just to keep that like longer leg going. I love this new P448. Look at how cute that little animal print is. Otherwise, totally clean and white, which I think is so fun with this. Now, I paired it back to this Tove T from Z Supply. Guys, actually this guy is almost a tunic length, but because it has a little cut up on the side, it's super, super easy to tuck. I love a black and white combination. I think it's so chic and so easy to wear and immediately makes you look put together. But let's be real, it's pretty cold everywhere. So I put on the jacket we have all been waiting for, that great front cover of our February catalog, Blank NYC quilted denim jacket. Guys, it is like wearing a cloud. And in this light blue wash, so, so yummy. You can see it's more of a relaxed fit. It's very similar to the Zeep Supply version we had earlier, as well as that darker wash blank denim we had earlier. I'm wearing my true size. Super comfy, super cute. And then, of course, Paired it back to these great little Sadie bracelets, and then I threw on that fun chain link bracelet you know I'm obsessed with, just for a little pop of color. Done. Such an easy, easy look. And again, when that weather turns, I lose the jacket, and I've got a put-together look that is, see, really just a t-shirt and jeans. I mean, how easy is that? Okay, here we go. Dare two for me today. I'm going to put on a pair of cutoffs. Bear with me, gang. We can do it. Okay. Before I put on my next like real, real look, I just wanted you to see this tee with cutoffs so you could see how versatile it is and how easy all of these pieces actually work together. So here is that Z Supply tee. This is what I was talking about, gang. Look, it's actually longer length. If you want to wear this with leggings, you could. I popped it on with that Jane cutoff from Cut. Oh man, I love this short. If you are a fan of the A Goldie Parker, if you loved the Gidget from Cut last year, this is like a marriage of the two. Open leg, great destruction, roomy in the backside. It is what cutoffs are made to look like. And then I kept on my P448s. Now, I have another look coming, but I just wanted you to see this real quick, and then we'll dive more details into these amazing shorts. So fun, right? But isn't this tea great? 
it's just a staple and it comes in multiple colors so it's a stock up okay hold on here okay. we go number two what's so fun i guess this is like 2.5 so what's so fun about today's collection we're talking about cut denim but all of these pieces work together so that great little black tee i showed it back with the um, cutoffs and then you could see how cute it was with the white denim equally true of this roan and ryan sweatshirt i love it with these cutoffs but it would be adorable back to those white jeans now i paired it with this great sorel sandal this is one of my favorite sandals we're getting this season for a multitude of reasons crazy comfortable super versatile in color you've got this kind of blushy taupe with a snake and black and white and it also kind of disappears on your foot which is another little styling tip a nude sandal just lengthens that leg like nobody's business and thank you very much i will take that when i'm wearing shorts so this jane cutoff i love it because it is a little looser on the leg so it's not going to give you that kind of suction feeling if you are a fan of the gidget this is a wider leg than the gidget style was a little bit more washed down a little bit more relaxed just overall it feels very vintage very lived in and very very comfortable now in cut cutoffs i do the same thing that i do in white denim i wear my normal size you know when cut jeans you normally go down a size in cutoffs and in white i wear my normal denim size i like that it feels relaxed and vintage and cool and easy and especially pair back to this great little sweatshirt exclusively ours this kind of bleach splatter i think is really cool it's a more relaxed fit i did a little half tuck to give myself some shape kept on my fun bracelets little ring stack and i'm good to go i mean how fun is this okay one more look coming up and i might sneak in a like 3.1 look just so you have another idea of this little capsule collection okay here we go okay look number three ah this is such a fun one this is a little bit out of my typical i'd say style and i think that's why i love it so very much it's a perfect way to usher in spring so i have got on the best straight leg denim you may have not yet put on your body this is the reese from cut now, why do I love this guy? Number one, it's more of a mid-rise. So if you are looking for something that is not so, so high in your tummy, I like this guy because it's still hitting above my hips, but not so, so high that I kind of, my torso gets swallowed up in it. Little bit of destruction, raw hem. Again, I might just cheat a little bit and cut another half inch or so off so I get a little more ankle showing. And then I paired it back to this fabulous blouse, the Kylie. It is romantic and beautiful and sexy and comfortable and fabulous. It works great if you are curvy. It's going to work great if you're petite. It has this really pretty volume sleeve. I love this neckline. It's face framing, V-neck, popped it on with this great little paper clip medallion necklace which i think accentuates it i lost the sadies just kept on the gold link and then put on these little georgia link earrings they actually come in a three pack this is just one of them for a little extra sparkle and then get used to it gang this is a shoe you're going to be seeing a whole heck of a lot from me this new little studded slide from dolce vita it also comes in black but i love the nude because a little style tip we just talked about leg lengthening now this ensemble tucked it in ensemble fancy word tucked in the whole shirt i think this would also be fabulous with the white jeans maybe i'll just slip them on real quick so you can see and do a quick shoe change for a little extra mm, oomph and then we're good to go told you i knew this is gonna be good Ugh. okay so here's the deal with white denim Two little tricks I did here with this blouse. Number one, I didn't do a full tuck, I did a half tuck. If you just want a little more coverage, if you just feel a little more comfortable in white, not full tucking, I get it, I hear you. This blouse, the Kylie, is the perfect one to do it because it's not too long, but it does give you a little tush coverage and that half tuck still gives you shape. Number two, I popped on a heel. 
I did it, gang. And this one is one you want to get your hands on quick. We're getting more, but they are selling like hotcakes. This little kind of stacked heel, it's nude. It's easy to wear the Pally from Dolce Vita. I love it because it's leg lengthening and so darn flattering. So whole nother look. This was an unintentional but so delightful capsule. You've got your cutoff, you've got your Reese, you've got your white denim, and then you've got all the pieces that mix and match. This great little Kylie blouse. Of course, the layer everybody needs from blank. A fun little pop sweatshirt, which also, by the way, would look great with that straight leg denim. And then that black tee that literally anchors every single look. Done. Buy them all. All that cut denim under 100 bucks. I mean, what a steal, guys. And you know the quality is impeccable. Okay, I hope this gave you some great ideas and some courage to get yourself into white and cutoffs and try that straight leg denim if you haven't yet, especially because that one's such a great, great fit. I hope you are surviving the cold. I hope this brings you some wishes for spring and we will see you soon. Take care, everybody.